N. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 81, Nasdaq's up 122, S&Ps are up 19. Gold, gold contract down $5, trading at 1959 an ounce. We have silver down 14 cents, $25, 5 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude off a buck 30, $74.12 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note up five ticks, trading 112.23. The 30-year up four ticks at 126.18 and King Dollar. King Dollar's down 71 ticks, 99.843. The euro is at 112, the yen is at 138, and the British pound is at 130 to one US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&P, folks. Bottom line, it's been a one-way trip, no doubt about that. Now, what's gonna get intriguing here is you get really light volume, I mean, in a monster way. So if we get a pullback, the last time that we got any, any type of juice there this morning was about, uh, yeah, about 12 points lower in the S&P. That's the 45, 43 area, so. You know, it's been a one-way trip all the way up. It's just grinding up. Now, if we look at the, the volumes, this is where it's going to get really wild. Um, this thing is contracting in a monster way. It, it contracted on Friday. Friday, we hit a high with 69 million. We're at 30 right now, okay? So it is what it is. Bottom line, you know, we'll see how the baby shakes out. We take a look at the Qs. Same setup inside the Qs. Qs out here. Yeah, Friday we hit a high out here with uh, 55 million to get 28 right now. And inside the Qs, the NQs, the number on the NQs that you could get a pullback. And when I say a pullback, I'm talking about before the close out here today. We're at 15,827. It'd be 15,781. It's not that heavy, really. Yeah, I'll put a line coming across it. It's right there. You know, that's where, that's the last time. We just grind it higher. The Qs came down and actually tested that. And then ground higher again. So bottom line, you know, and it has to do with the dollar. If you take a look at this dollar, what you're going to see is pretty clear. The dollar, bottom line at the morning, you know, had a little juice in it. We were at 100.181. It just gave it up in spades, man. Yeah, we're at 99, 835. So, you know, if you don't get any bounce in the dollar, this market will continue higher in a monster way, too. And in the dollar, on a longer term, the dollar wants much lower price. Stay right there, folks, and come right back.